The Psalms of Morning Prayer for Thursday of the third week of Easter. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, Lord, open my lips and my mouth will proclaim your praise. City of God, you are the source of our life. With music and dance, we shall rejoice in you. Alleluia. Psalm 87. On the holy mountain is his city, cherished by the Lord. The Lord prefers the gates of Zion to all Jacob's dwellings. Of you are told glorious things, O city of God. Babylon and Egypt I will count among those who know me. Philistia, Tyre, Ethiopia, these will be her children, and Zion shall be called Mother, for all shall be her children. It is he, the Lord Most High, who gives each his place. In his register of peoples, he writes, These are her children, and while they dance, they will sing. In you, all find their home. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. City of God, you are the source of our life. With music and dance, we shall rejoice in you. Alleluia. A reading from the letter of Paul to the Romans, chapter 8. If Christ is in you, the body is dead because of sin while the Spirit lives because of justice. If the Spirit of Him who raised Jesus from the dead dwells in you, then He who raised Jesus from the dead will bring your mortal bodies to life also through His Spirit dwelling in you. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Father, in this holy season, we come to know the full depth of your love. You have freed us from the darkness of error and sin. Help us to cling to your truths with fidelity. We ask this through our Lord, Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you and the Holy Spirit, one God, forever and ever. May the Lord bless us, protect us from all evil, and bring us to everlasting life. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Hi, I'm David. At the end of each Psalm of Morning Prayer, from here on, hopefully every day, I'm going to devote one minute of time to a question or a comment or a reflection or a testimony, something. And I'd like you to participate in this. In fact, if you'd like to send me an email, and we can use this space to read that email or to talk about anything that you're interested in, please do so. My address is penitentis1 at gmail.com. It's on the little blurb that's included with every day's Psalm of Morning Prayer. That's penitentis1 at gmail.com. Thanks, and hope to hear from you soon. <laughs> The Psalms of Morning Prayer is brought to you by the Confraternity of Penitents, penitents.org.
I'm David Rollins. Join us weekdays as we continue to pray from the unceasing and universal prayer of the whole people of God, the Liturgy of the Hours.